Hey, good morning, everyone. So let's go ahead and take a look at our winds. So our winds at the surface are coming in from a north northwesterly flow anywhere from 5 to 13 miles per hour. However, in the mid levels, our winds have already shifted into a southerly flow, bringing in that moisture back into the Rio Grande Valley. And that's why we are going to be a little bit warmer today. And eventually at the surface, our winds will shift into a southerly flow as well, which means that our temperatures will be warming up quite a bit as we head into the end of the work week. But for this morning, we can see a little bit of a difference within our temperature change within the last 24 hours. So we are a couple degrees warmer today as opposed to yesterday. So that means our highs are going to do the same. So the high for Brownsville is going to be 63, Harlingen at 62, Wessico 59, and Rio Grande City as well under mostly cloudy skies. However, we're not in the clear for the rain just yet. We could potentially get a few more showers filtering in later on today and our morning lows are also going to be a little bit warmer. So the morning low for Browns was going to be 58, Harlingen 55, Wessico 54, and Roma 52 under mostly cloudy skies. And those rain chances will be sticking around not only for today, but for the next several days. We could potentially see rain coverage anywhere from a 10 to a 20%. So these are very low, so not everyone's going to see the rain, but I do recommend giving yourself some extra time before heading out the door and maybe even packing a light rain jacket because again we are going to see rain coming in and out throughout the next couple of days so here's a closer look for today mostly cloudy skies a few showers here and there but they're mainly going to be just along the coast and then as we head into Wednesday morning a little bit more shower activity is going to be expected under mostly cloudy skies and then for Thursday Thursday is going to be a little bit different because we are expecting to get a warm front into the region producing more shower activities for us across the Rio Grande Valley and and our clouds are going to be breaking up just a little bit and we'll be left with partly cloudy skies for Thursday afternoon. So it's going to be a little bit more pleasant and those temperatures are going to be a little bit warmer as well. So here is a closer look on those temperatures. So as we head into the middle of the work week and toward the weekend, those temperatures are going to be in the upper 70s, close to 80 degrees, but not quite. And then as we head into the weekend, we could potentially get another cold front, but it's not really going to do anything for us. It's just going to bring in that cool and drier air behind it, which is going to set up our temperatures a little bit cooler for the next work week.